What's this? <coughs> Shuttle station. Hey. Isn't that where you're supposed to go? That's some really fucking nice texturing, by the way. Oh, shit. I mean, I guess so, if you can't open it naturally. Ah. Well, thanks, little guy. All right, see ya. still works, huh? Yeah. That is cool. The oh, audio. Yeah. I like that effect a lot, but I just, I really hate the sound of the buzzer going. How loud are your headphones? Very. Jeez. Let's hope the shuttle still work. I can control audio on my end. My... Button Z. Oh, I can't see shit. Yeah. How did I... Where did I get a flashlight? Hmm, curious, curious. When did you get a flashlight? Hmm? <laughs> 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 hmm? Just remember, I left that robot there getting absolutely fried. What was that? Hmm? What was that? I left that robot over there getting absolutely toasted. And he fucking deserved every inch of it. He's a dick. I can't hear you. Don't worry, I'll fix it. Somehow. He was the guy that we just found dead. So his consciousness was put into that robot. Yeah, I kinda pieced that together. Butthole. Oh. Oh my god. Punch it. Punch it. Smack the shit out of it. What the hell? I don't know, if a fucking butthole tried to eat my hand, I'd punch it immediately. Nah, man. That's just the, uh... Macro Fox's, uh, first owner's ass. His name is Marcus. Moving on. <laughs> no, I don't think we will. What the fuck? No, seriously though, Asher, what the fuck? What? No, stop, stop bringing that nah, shit up, man, it upsets it's just a, me. It's just a cringe for Sonus. Ass, you know? Oh, speaking of cringe furry shit, um... When we were playing Resonance... Re Resident, wh whatever. Resonite. Resonite last night with, uh, when, when I was playing with Kate and Combo. Before you continue that, I'm gonna cut you off here. I plan on trying to get my model to work in that game. How am I going to do it? No idea. Good fucking luck with that. That's a um, person. Yeah, I can see that. Um, we went to a rave club that was in the that was in the game, and um, you know, of course, I put on the iconic all the single furries, as I have the God given right to. <laughs> Immediately kicked. No, actually, uh, because me, Kate, and Connor were really the only ones in there. Um, they did not like it. I had a blast. <laughs> Mostly because I was laughing at them being wildly upset at the song. All the single furries. All, all the, the single, single furries. furries. All the single furries. All the single furries. Now put your paws up. Uh. You know. And the main convo started showing Kate really well animated fucking music videos, like Sames and shit. Hey, are you? Don't hurt me. Can I help? It won't let me die. Nothing is allowed to die. God, could you be a ma could you imagine being hooked up to that? I was going to Theta. Anything I can do? If you see Masters or Holland, tell them I need help. Okay? Amy needs help. Amy needs some self-respect. Help yourself. No. Aww. Shit. Are you okay? Are you okay? I don't know. I wanna go home. 
so can you like kill her dead? Can you just stab, shove it up her nose? Oh fuck. Well, I mean, technically though, isn't that what she wanted? She wanted to die? I wouldn't if I was like that. I mean, Sam. Whatever this was was not allowing her to die. No. Yeah, but that's the point. That's what I'm trying to get at, right? Why would why would he feel bad about? And like, it was connected to this power box. Yeah. And when I unplugged it, it, you know, I, I unplugged Grandma. <laughs> Whoops. Well, I mean, fucking. To be fair, you needed to charge your phone, so. <laughs> Can't be you too from bad Michigan. If you've never done this before, <laughs> right? Does sick backflip. Yeah. Yup. We turn this shit on. We put your paws up. Uh, it's Marcus's butthole. <sighs> you can thank my degenerate friends for that. More specifically, Ice 2. Ice 2 is a funny boy, but goddamn, he's a freak. Hey, Ice 2, if you're watching this, I think you're a fucking freak. Not that I think Ice 2 would ever watch bread plays. I think Ice 2 has a better taste in fucking media consumption than that. It's nothing inherently in this it's just the caption is what makes it so much worse. So what's the caption? Read it. How do you fucking go back on this stupid goddamn device? It's the same shit as yours. It's not. Mine Look, is very the clearly defined. Right fucking there. I can't read it from there. Read it out to me. You read it. Okay, fine. <laughs> I fucking read the first five words. <laughs> Just, sir, that is the asshole of some 23-year-old dude's macro blue dragon OC. His name is Marcus. <laughs> <laughs> And it's just this I dude polishing a resin this. stone, like a resin stone. I just smash your fucking phone for you. Anyways. Oh, that's ice too for you. Pass. Shall I continue? Um, Alright, I'll take the train. This is what it's... This is what it's like getting to your place. Can you just rip one? What the fuck was that sound? Uh, it sounds like you just ripped a fat one. Okay, wait, maybe I did. It was fucking tall. That right there is a cat. I'm allergic to those beings. That's true. Break out in hives and explode when you see a cat. Yeah. Damn, this is what happens after you let me drive. Damn. Nicest female driver. <laughs> Average Toronto driver. Oh, Mudgy, you got another mat on your neck. Another what? She's got a little mat on her neck. Oh, yeah, I know. Those things are everywhere on my other dogs. And every time we clear one, another one comes up. What's that? Matt? Yeah. Yeah, they're everywhere on my dog. Yeah. Every time we clear one, another one comes back like a week later. Are you alright? The system says the section is sealed for suspected hull breach. No, I'm not alright. What the hell happened in the world? Why are we underwater? Well, you're really out of place. I'll take care of it some other time. Well, don't worry about that right now. It's okay, much much. You're like cut those out, right? Uh, sometimes. Sometimes I'll just rip them. Sometimes I'll just rip them apart, just enough so that she can take care of them. But if they're in a position like this, where she cannot reach, then yeah, I usually cut them off. No problem. What's going on up there? I want a cat like that so bad. I want a cat like that so bad. A fluffy one or an irritating one? A fluffy one. You okay? No, you don't. I like fluffs. No. It's not worth fucking dealing with all the hassle of trying to take care of them. Have you ever seen a fluffy dog? No. Yeah, well, I have one, and it is agony. It's just as bad with a cat. She gets mats on her bum a lot. And they're fucking irritating to take out. Sorry everybody, I'm talking about my cat Smudge. Uh, picture up on screen. And uh, she's an absolute fucking sweetie cutie pie, but um... She's also a fucking irritant. <laughs> uh, really quick, can you pause- can you pause the game? Over by my Switch games, there should be a pair of flower scissors. Can you grab those for me? Thank you. Yo, uh, what time is it?
Five o'clock. Yeah, we got like two hours left. Oh boy. Okay, now before you start the game again, can you do me a favor and toss that on the bin? Doesn't that feel better, Mudge Mudge? Doesn't that feel better? You're such a good girl being so good. She's been obsessed with laying on my lap recently. I kind of had a funny feeling this would happen. <laughs> so, yeah, that's why I'm not really against it. Oh, you getting down? Alright, bye bye. Bye bye. You went out? Fuck, I forgot the Omni tool back in the shuttle. Not oh, great. What'd you do that one for? You want to light on or do you want it off? Off. It's very distracting. I want it off for immersion. Toast. And for spooky. Ah, that's fucking loud. Right in my fucking ear hole. Oh, I remember this part of the game. Oh, oh fuck. Oh, is it a fun part? I wouldn't say f Well, yeah. It sure is fucking weird effect. I know how they did it, it's like super basic, but it's still so weird. Well, at least I kind of know how they did it. I can fly and land them, right? I mean, really? How big can this ocean be? I don't know, about the size of an ocean, probably. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, give or take. Size of an ocean. Size of an ocean, size of the Bermuda Triangle, size of an ocean, maybe the size of a lake. How much water do you think you could, like, get away with drinking before you die? Um... Like, okay, obviously, like, biological restrictions aside. In like a completely hypothetical situation, how much water do you reasonably think you could get away with drinking before like something bad happens? Well, you just... What's the point of that question? Without biological fucking limitations... Well, I mean, you'd still you have like the psychological limitations no limit. of it. Hmm? Like, you'd still have all the psychological things, so you'd still have like the feeling of full, because that's like almost entirely psychological. So, like... Probably some furry inflation plot around there. <laughs> Why do you always have to fucking involve weird degenerate shit? Oh, that robot's not happy with me. Get it. over here! That was a Mortal Kombat thing. Boy, I... Okay, here's a better question. What's like, um, the most irrational feat of strength you think you could pull off? Be my dad in an arm wrestle. Really? Have yeah. you seen that man? I mean, yeah, he's, uh, scary still. <laughs> <laughs> well, okay. Remember, like, a few days ago when I, when, uh, I ran into him at Safeway? Uh, -huh. uh so the thing was, right, I... I never get run into it, like, in public. Ever. Mm -hmm. It's always a case of, like, it's either my mom or my dad. Very rarely my dad, mostly my mom. So when someone comes up behind us and goes, Oh, hey, Brennan. I'm just like, um, hi, hello, yes, I know who you are. Yeah. Like, it took me, like, a genuine, like, five or six seconds to process who the fuck was talking to me before I realized, Oh, wait. Catherine? That's his dad. <laughs> You know. Ah. 
Did you ever check out that game Observer? Observer? No. Yeah, did you ever check that out? I don't think so. Oh man, I've heard it's pretty cool. Hey, down here. Hi. No, not you too. I was really hoping you were human. Don't let the circuitry fool you. I was human once. Can't take any more. This is everything's fucked. I was human nothing once. Left. Nothing left. Calm down. <laughs> it's not the end of the world. You sure? It sure as hell looks like it. For all I know, there's no one left except for me. What do you mean? I'm right here. Don't take this the wrong way. But I meant any humans left except for me. Have you looked at yourself lately? You're a walking, talking diving suit with some electronics left on for good measure. I... I don't... You don't want to think about it? We'll start thinking about it. I... I, I don't want to do this anymore. I don't want to be this. I want out. Before you do anything hasty, could you help me with something? No, I don't... I don't think I'm you're fucking deserving of it, to be honest, bitch. You want to be fucking around. smarmy to me? No. Project. How can anything possibly matter when you know you're a stupid robot in a stupid dead world? Okay, focus. I need you to fix me so I can get back to work. Then you can sulk as much as you want. You gotta be kidding, right? I think I have a better chance of building myself a time machine than of putting you back together. I just need to access the computer. Oh, is that an Omni tool you're carrying? Oh, the door opener? I picked it up at Upsilon where I woke up. I don't have to do. Plug it into the terminal. Sure, whatever. When the Omni tool is loaded, just plug my Cortex chip into the tool. What's a Cortex chip? It will be obvious. I'll eject it for you. Just grab your chip and slide it into the Omni tool. I don't know. If a woman told me to grab her Cortex chip after she ejected it, I'd, I'd be met with hesitation, to be honest. The Omni tool is ready now. Should be easy enough. Just pick up the chip and slide it into the Omni tool. Why does a robot chip fit a door open? It's standardized connect. Uh, Catherine? Alright. Let's give this a try. Custom Cortex chip found. Shutting down helper chain. Have a nice day. If there's pretty much anything will fit. Oh, this feels weird. I'm in the Omnitool? Thanks. So, what's the project about? My project? Oh, well, I saved all the people on the station as brain scans and put them into an artificial world. We were going to launch it into space to save from, uh, well, all of this. Are you telling me that you were going to launch a computer world filled with people into space? Yes. It was just a pet project at first, but it got really serious after the comet took out the surface. Then, suddenly it became very important, and it was officially named the Ark. That's appropriate. How far did you get? I don't know. That version of me that I am. It came from a scan I did pretty early on. The living Catherine could very well have finished the project and launched it. I guess she could even still be alive. Huh. Weird thought. So the talking robots, are they also scans you did? They could be, but I doubt it. I'd expect much more sense if that was the case. Ah, all right, silent. What's happening? I managed to won't upload the save to your Steam cloud, by the way, because we decided to play it when we're at my place. Oh. What's up? Upload the save as a Steam cloud? Like, upload the save in Steam cloud, so if we decide to resume it at my place, we can't. I need to know that the Ark is safe. Sure, Well, yeah, I mean, that already will. Okay. I already have all that automatically set up. What was it you said before? You're from Toronto? Yeah, I... Just went in for a brain scan, and suddenly, here I am. That doesn't make any sense. How... Why would anyone bring a scan from Toronto? You think that's strange? What if I tell you it was back in 2015? Whoa. Check the computer in the other room. Actually, hmm. Maybe going to your place wouldn't be that bad if I signed in on to my Steam library, because I have a few VR games that would be really fun to try out. That is true. Though VR is a bit of a pain in the ass. You could try Half-Life Alex. I can try Half-Life Alex. I can try Beat Saber. It'd be interesting. Maybe. We'll see how I feel kind of around like six, maybe.
Butthole. Butthole, 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 poke it, poke it, poke it. I'm never gonna be able to get that fucking thought out of my head now. <laughs> it's Marcus. You fucking ruined it for yourself. No, I used to ruin it for me. Every blue donut I see now is just gonna... Every blue glazed donut is just fucking like some... 23-year-old's fucking microfurosis named Marcus. Yep. Awesome. Is this from inside the Ark? Ooh, that's pretty. That's some early renders of the world inside. Looks a whole lot comfier than this place. before that creature was strangely overbearing yeah it basically exploded with electromagnetism that's bad for us right confusing at least gives the senses a good punch sure is fascinating isn't it i found a tracker homed in on the ark oh that's clever i wonder if i thought of that does it still work? I really need to know what happened to it. I think so. It's doing something at least. Where is it? Hold on. I'm trying to find it. Please let it be safe. Oh, uh, do it in like the dead center of Canada. Oh. No, try that. Try the Indian Ocean. Oh, no, never mind. 